Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Another evoking news for the nation. The flu season of 2010 to 11 is about to begin, and the public is being requested to take note of certain facts and resort to certain necessary vaccinations. According to official reports, last year's flu was predominantly the H1N1 or swine flu, and the victims were largely children and pregnant women. This year's season is predicted to be more typical, one with the elderly being targeted the most. The U.S. Centers for Disease Prevention and Control say that the flu seasons are unpredictable. It, however, supports the view that the upcoming season would be harder on senior citizens. In a typical year, majority of the population that gets affected are the elderly. In the wake of this, the CDC has approved a new high-dose Fluzone vaccine for seniors made by Sanofi Pasteur with higher doses of antigen in order to initiate better response to vaccination since immunity levels are low in seniors. It shall be single shot vaccine unlike last year's which had two shots and shall be effective against H1N1 virus, the Perth H3N2 virus and the B Brisbane virus. In addition, there won't be any shortage of the vaccines. Last year, high-risk groups were given the shots first and the others were made to wait. CDC confirms the vaccines are available in abundance post the vaccination boom last year. It urged all above the age of six months to go for vaccination unless they have or any allergies against the medicine. The vaccines shall be available from the doctors, country clinics, pharmacies as well as supermarkets. Regarding the administration of the shots, CDC said that a new law has been brought forth that permits trained pharmacists to vaccinate the adults. Well, we all need to take care of ourselves with this H1N1 